Hey Spark, how's it going, man? Hope all is good. I uh, actually picked up this dryer. Says it takes a couple of cycles for it to dry the clothes. I have no idea. Um, he says the washer works, though. I have it all hooked up and ready to give it a test. Run it through all the different loads. So, uh, Samsung has some rust, so of course I'm going to have to may uh, maybe clean up, prep it a little bit. Uh, I paid 40 for for these. Um, yeah, so hopefully it's nothing crazy, and he's true to his word, and it's not no shaft or bearings. Uh, I got this for free, if it's thrown on someone's driveway, I just went up and knocked on the door and said, uh, it takes a couple cycles, or sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't, I have no idea. Opened it up, uh, it looks a little burned, I don't know what that means, if that's normal or not. Uh... This is the one that you said needs probably needs an actuator. Turns on, powers everything. Um, I'm gonna test it out. Make sure there's no crazy noises coming out from it. This one is from the scrap guy. Paid fifteen fifty or sixteen for it. Uh, turns on, there's no codes. Maybe I have to f fuck with it. And figure out if code will turn on or just run it and see if it works. Because he has no previous history on it. And it might work just fine. Make sure there's no loud noises or jet engine noises coming out of it. Got this one for free too from a lady. Um, it was a code DL popped up or DL5. And it's something to do with the lid switch. Like how it's not closing all the way. So it's not wanting to uh, work. But, I mean, it's an expensive washing machine. She just threw it away for free. I couldn't believe it. Uh, I picked this up from a guy. He just got brand new units. It's a matching set. Whirlpool. Um, I don't know. I paid like $30 for these. He says he had them. But it looks like they've been outside. And it's not something I really noticed. He had them inside when I got them. But there's a few pine needles. He said they work. So, I mean, if they don't work... Um, I'll just scrap for 15 bucks and make my money back. Uh, these two are what I got from, I think they're, yeah, these two are was what I got from the scrapper. Uh, I paid 15 bucks, definitely need some prepping, need to get this unit. Um, you know, I don't know if they work, uh, I haven't tested any of them yet, so this is another matching set from the scrap guy. Uh, said a common thing is missing the power cord. Uh, thankfully my grandpa has a few extra of these and the scrap guy said he would sell me extra uh, or just give them to me all the extra parts and and some uh, some power cords for the low if I want to get them so it might be worth it. But yeah I just want to give you a little update man and uh, you know I appreciate all your help and if you have uh, any tips or pointers Oh, and uh, I was asking you, what paint do you use to to make everything look nice? I know like a lot of guys spray paint, but you said you use a, a four-inch roller, I believe, and a in white paint. And I was just curious of what that was. You know, I've watching been watching a lot of YouTube videos as well of you know, especially with dryers, like each part, and uh, you know how to test them with their with your meter and making sure you got the right power and everything's working. You know, it could be something stupid like that, but, you know, I still got a lot to learn, but, uh, like I said, a lot of these I got for free, or for nothing, I think I'm a hundred, hundred ten dollars in, maybe, so far, so, I mean, not bad, and if, you know, the, the scrapped ones work fine, you don't need to repair any bearings, or, uh, the shaft, uh, looks good to me, man, and this was just one Craigslist ad and one Facebook post a matter of a day and a half, two days, for me picking it up. I mean, I have literally like 10 to 15 other people trying to get me to pick up their washers and dryers. Same issue, uh, it makes a loud noise for the washer, or it's, it's not washing the clothes, it's loud, da da da, this probably sounds like, or it's, it's not agitating, like you said, uh, the dogs, 
I have to get better on showing up and being able, being able to inspect things better and get and get a better eye on it. But I think that'll come with time, you know, watching some YouTube videos and and whatnot and through experience obviously. But uh, you know, I just wanna thank you for all your help and uh I appreciate it, man, and one day hopefully I can be like you and get to a point where uh I can have a guy just fix these and pay him whatever and not just handle the sales. All right, man. Thank you.